fortunate series of events for a tri-state woman. Taryn Ware was involved in a crash on I-74, and she says in the process of all of that, she lost her wedding dress. Of all things, and that dress was in the car with her, and now it's gone. In a story you'll see only on 9 on your side, our T.J. Parker spoke with Taryn about her quest to find it. That's me. Like any newlywed, Taryn Ware shares memories of her happiest day wearing her wedding dress. This is a picture of me and my dad when I was walking down the aisle. Her happiest memory, though, has turned into a bad nightmare. Taryn was in a car crash on I-74 at Colerain Avenue a few weeks ago. Although she was injured, her main concern was her dress. As the EMTs took her to the hospital, they told her it would be fine in her car, but it wasn't. I went to go get my belongings out of my vehicle and no sign of my wedding dress. And I was, I was just a mess. Like, I was just a disaster. Everything else was in there, but no dress. And it, it just hurt my feelings. Taryn had the dress in her car to get it clean. She and her husband are having a ceremony next month to surprise her grandma, who wasn't able to attend her wedding last year because she had cancer. We're going to surprise her and renew our vows for her. Now everything is just ruined because I have no dress. We was just going to have a little celebration, but now it's, it's kind of ruined almost because even if you get another dress, it's not the same. Taryn's mother, Yolanda Chenault, says she's praying somebody comes forward with information about where the dress may be. I'm just praying that she gets it back. Taryn took to social media to try and find her dress. Already, she says there's been over 100 people post about it, trying to get it back for her. It breaks my heart terribly. Taryn is thankful she wasn't too badly hurt in the crash, but she says she's hurt knowing her dress is gone. You don't think that your belongings are going to be gone after something tragic like that. Taryn says she's filed a police report in hopes of finding that dress, but as of right now, she says she hasn't had any luck. In Northside, I'm TJ Parker, 9 on your side.